for me, you know, the biggest hurdle is is team. As an entrepreneur, I don't particularly like dealing with people or team. I just want everyone to be on board with me. And uh, that was a massive realization that in actual fact, everyone just goes to work for themselves. Hello and welcome to Callum Connect's micro podcast. Our guest today is Jason Greystone. Jason is an entrepreneur and investor who became financially free at 29 years old. He's the host of Always Free Podcast, the number one podcast for financial empowerment and wealth creation. Biggest hurdle in business for me personally was dealing with staff and getting staff on board because entrepreneurs typically when they have an idea um, all they want to do is create new things and they want basically create a disconnect in team because they've got something in their mind where they know what they're going after and they want something new all the time so they chop and change and they get bored and they want to create and create and the team aren't on board with it or they don't give clear directions to the team so the team don't know what they're doing team become quite unhappy and then you know it is like a disconnect and it's kind of this struggle because you need if you want to build a business you need the team on board um so the way that i overcome this is realize that actually everyone every anyone who ever got a job really just got a job to fund their life and their values and do the things that they want to do so if you want to get people to stay in your business and get on board you really need to put some time and effort into understanding what their values are and basically what we do is create a a proposition for them or a position in the business for them explaining how they can get more of what they want in their life whilst helping us get what we want and then once they can see that you know as long as they don't have a massive value shift uh, and you can and you can kind of keep on top of that by doing a, a reassessment every now and then um, they're going to remain loyal and they're going to remain on board with your vision um, because they can see by helping you get what you want they'll get what they want so the next step after that was to really just make sure that you delegate and and find out who's good at what and what ac- people actually really enjoy doing because being good at something and actually enjoying it is is two different things and if you can align the two then that is a massive bonus so one of the things we did was spent some time doing a matrix where we identified all the missing gaps all the missing positions in the business we asked everyone what they do and what they like doing and what they're good at um, and what they want to do and just by doing that gives a really transparent view on what everyone's doing and what people's goals are and what their values are and then you can start to delegate and prioritize uh, certain delegations and what team what parts are missing who's going to do what going forward and it just gets the team excited and on board about you know what we're moving into so for me you know the biggest hurdle is is team as an entrepreneur i don't particularly like dealing with people or team i just want everyone to be on board with me and uh, that was a massive realization that in actual fact everyone just goes to work for themselves uh, so if you can just help them figure out you know working for you is going to help them live their life and have stress free in their life uh, they'll be on board with you a bit more and then it's just a case of making sure they're all in the right place and they're enjoying what they're doing and they're not you know they and if they do hate something about their job it's your job to kind of fill that hole and, and prioritize that delegation as quickly as possible so that's really the biggest hurdle for me if you can get that right uh, it's very scalable you know you can really start to grow um, a team a great team and when you've got a great team you, you can pretty much build uh, anything so hope you got uh, value from that it's uh, it's something that really helped me and uh, I'm sure it'll help many other entrepreneurs listening thanks for having us if you enjoyed this podcast and would like to find more inspiring information about entrepreneurs around the world doing incredible things make your way to enterprisezone.cc 